it's me again, Teacher Donna, and welcome to our time. So today's our time. As you can see, I am holding traffic lights here, and we are going to make our own traffic lights, and you will do this at home as well. So we have stop and wait and go. So everybody, can you say red means stop? Yellow means wait. Green means go. Okay, and I also have here a paper. So you are going to make your own traffic lights and you will make a paper just like this at all. Now I am excited, so let's start. So for today's art, these are the materials that we need. As you can see, today we will be creating our DIY traffic lights. I already prepared three circles here and if you are at home you can use a bowl maybe a small bowl like this all you need is to get your yellow red and green colored papers so let's say for example this one you will just make a pattern circle pattern get your pencil and then your scissors and cut the pattern that you make and once it's done it will look like this all right so you need green red and yellow i also have here a black cardboard so this is not a bond paper this is thicker than the bond paper so if you have like this at home you can use it or if you don't have if you have a bun paper and a box then you can use that box just cut and make it like this all right so what else aside from that we also need some glue of course our scissors our pencil when you make a pattern of your circles marker or if you have pencil pen at home then you can use it what else? I don't have a scotch tape, so I will use double-sided tape and a string and another paper, so this is color white and then this is just a spare paper that I have here. So these are the things that we need for today's art and I can't wait to start, so let's start! First, we have color red and color red. What does it mean in traffic lights? It means stop. Yes or no? Okay, stop. So, I will write the word stop. So, let's get our pencil pen. Okay. And now let's get our yellow paper. What does it mean for the traffic lights? Yellow means wait, right? So I will write the word wait. Okay, there you go. Now, the last one, we have color green and it means, what does it mean? Color green means go. So, let's write go. Now, it's time to get the glue and let's glue them on the paper. Okay, last one, our go. Okay, so 
I think we are done. Everybody, can we read again? Stop, wait, go. So, red means stop, yellow means wait, green means go. It's time to get our string here. So, teacher Donna will put it at the back. I will try first because I am going to wear it. Okay, so I think this size. This is our string as you can see. Now I am going to get our tape. And at the back of our traffic lights, teacher Donna will attach. Okay, let's Put some tape. So this is what it looks like now and teacher Donna will wear this, okay? But before I wear it, now it's time to... Okay, let's put it here first. And it's time to get our paper. So this one, you also need another paper, okay? And teacher Donna wants you to write a message to all the drivers out there. So I am going to... Send the words that you will write on your paper. So number one, we have, please be careful when driving. Number two, drive safe, save a life. Number three, please drive carefully. No texting while driving, please. Please don't drive if you are drunk. And number six, don't drive if you are sleepy, please. And number seven, Please drive slowly in a school zone. So there are seven and teacher Donna will assign what message are you going to write on your paper. So one message for one student. Alright? So I think teacher Donna will write drive safe, save a life. Okay? So this is the message that I wrote on my paper and teacher Donna will give you what message will you write on your paper, okay? Don't copy this. I will give one for you. So each of you will be different. All of you will have something to write. Now it's time to get this. So you can use any, any paper that you have there or stick. And teacher Donna will put it here. Okay. So I think I will get this glue and just glue it at the back. Okay. And then I am going to attach it here. So let's put some glue here as well. Okay. Now, I will put some tape to make it strong. Okay, just one is enough. So there you go. Now we have a paper and this is our message for the drivers. So everybody, this is our traffic lights here. And I lower the camera so you can see. And teacher Donna will wear Okay, this is what it looks like at the back. And now, we are going to wear it. There you go. So, you will be a human traffic light. 
and I want you to take a video explaining what do these colors mean. So, and you are also going to hold this like this. Okay, can we read? Drive safe. Save a life. Drive safe. Save a life. So your mom and dad will help you to read and memorize what you wrote on the paper. So this is what it looks like. I want you to take a picture holding your paper and wearing your traffic light. Oh wait, let's get the crown. Okay, so I am wearing my crown, okay? So you can get your crown that you made and you are going to like this. And you will take a picture, take a picture just like this. And then I want you to take a video, take a video explaining what is this. For example, you say, traffic lights. Red means stop. Yellow means wait. Green means go. Drive safe. Save a life. Okay, so that's it. You are going to explain and then read the one that you wrote on the paper. And I think that's it for today's Circle Time. Teacher Donna will see you again tomorrow. Goodbye, everybody!